The Idaho Transportation Department is improving the University Boulevard and State Highway 33 interchanges, exit 332 and 333 on US 20 in Rexburg. US 20 is the main transportation corridor for Rexburg and much of East Idaho. As this area continues to grow, these two interchanges are expected to reach unacceptable delays. To address the traffic needs of the Rexburg community and improve safety, the two interchanges will be rebuilt using a diverging diamond interchange, also known as a DDI. Idaho's first DDI was built in Chubbuck in 2013, and several surrounding states also have DDIs, including Utah, Wyoming, and Oregon. ITD worked with technical experts, local leadership, and the community to develop the DDI designs for this project. The DDIs in Rexburg will be cost-effective and help meet future traffic needs of the area. These DDIs will reduce congestion, improve safety, reduce injuries and crashes, and move high volumes of left-turning traffic. Also, the interchange structures will not need to be rebuilt using the DDI design. Therefore, the cost of construction will be reduced. What is a diverging diamond interchange, and how does it work? A DDI is a type of interchange in which two directions of traffic temporarily cross over the opposite side of the road. This allows for free running left and right turns onto highway entrance ramps. Motorists entering the interstate have two options. One, they can merge right and enter the highway with the on-ramp. Two, once on the left side of the road, Drivers can choose to turn left onto the on-ramp and merge with traffic from the other direction without having to stop. Motorists going straight through the intersection proceed through a second traffic signal and follow their lane back to the right side of the road. Motorists exiting the highway will use the off-ramp to merge with no stoplight. Pavement markings and signals direct motorists where they need to go. DDIs are considerably safer for bicyclists and pedestrians to cross. They will use a signalized pedestrian crossing and then will be directed through pedestrian walkways. Bicyclists and pedestrians will share the sidewalk. Construction of the new DDIs is anticipated to occur in summer of 2024. Each interchange will be fully closed, one at a time, while crews work to construct the new DDIs. As one interchange is being constructed, the other interchange will remain open as a detour route. Each interchange will be closed for approximately six weeks, and US-20 will remain open during construction. Fully closing each interchange will allow crews to work much faster and complete both interchanges in one construction season. To find out more information about the US-20 Rexburg Interchange Project, please visit itdprojects.org slash projects slash US 20 Rexburg.